Good morning, everybody. It's Randy Richard in the shop. I'm going to demonstrate the nail knot tool uh, I made for my friends. Uh, I did not invent this. I uh, saw one and I made my version of it. So, what I have here is some fly line. And this is 20 pound test amnesia. This is a monofilament, uh, supposedly a memory free monofilament. It works good for shooting heads, it's cheap, and it lasts, a, lasts you a couple of years uh, per shot. This is a 200 foot roll, and I usually don't put any more than 100 feet uh, on or roughly around that. So you can get uh, a couple loads out of that, or and you can flip it around too, end for end. So anyway, so here's the tool. There's the needle, the tube. I usually pull this out and retain the, the cord a couple times around the clip. Makes it easy. Pull the needle out of the way. <sighs> Got bugs in the shop here this morning. Some people call them noceums. We call them dog pecker flies. And you can just imagine why we call them that. So, you take the tube, lay the fly line parallel to the tube, take your amnesia or whatever you're going to tie on there, lay it parallel in the opposite direction. <sighs> Bugs are bad. Pinch the whole works. Wrap the amnesia, I'm going to wrap the amnesia around, to get it started here, back along itself five to six times uh, for this size line, works well. It's five, uh, six there. Uh, smaller stuff you can go more, seven or eight times. Back down the tube. And push it down and you're gonna pull that whole tube out of there and then you have their tag end over here on the back side keep a pinch between your fingers work the two ends slowly a little snugger so you can open it open up your fingers lubricate it with a little spit works good work it a little tighter until you feel comfortable that you can let go of it and it stays formed up You'll have to push that together sometimes a little bit and pull in at the same time both ends. My fingers are slippery this morning. I'm having a hell of a time pulling, but there we go. There's your knot, a nail knot. Get it nice and tight and test it. I don't know how that looks, but try to get a little closer. I don't have macro or anything, but that's it. And you can just put undo their cord and back together away it goes. There's your nail knot. Uh, you can trim these. Nice and close, pretty much. Ready to fish? Pretty simple knot. Thank you. The tool, nail knot tool. This is a view number two, just try to give you a different perspective. Remove the needle. So we're going to use just the tube portion. I wrap the cord around the clip a couple times just to hold it out of the way. There's the needle. Fly line. We're using the amnesia. Lay 
laying it opposite there, parallel. Wrap around, back along itself. Very hard to show this, but hard to get even get it going sometimes here. Five to six times around. Sorry. Usually sufficient with this size line. Yeah, I'll try to show you. Now we're going to stick it the tag end of the amnesia back down the tube. Push the whole works back out the other way. And we have the tag end now sticking out over here. Right over here. Then we're going to work them each end snug to like can let go a little bit lube it up a little spit works good pull it a little tighter work them till you feel you can let go you might have to align them a little bit use your fingernail and pull tight at the same time together My fingers are rather slippery this morning. But anyway, pull it tight. There we go. Trim. There's your nail knot. Pretty quick, pretty easy with the right tool. Anything will work. Plastic tubing I've used. I've used soda straws. But this one here is small, easy to carry with me. It doesn't collapse, which is nice. The stainless steel tube hypodermic needle. So that's it. And I can see I left I only took off the point. I left that open at at the slight angle that it's been ground for the hypodermic needle and it makes it easier to stick in there. Actually it works pretty well. The, uh, see I successfully tied a knot around this. There we go. Pull the threads out. Stow the needle back and you're off and running. Hopefully that's a view from a different angle. All right, thanks a lot.